Hello kids. In this video, we are going to revise the lesson and solve the exercise. Okay? Then look here. Words to know, democracy no, central government no, state government no, and union territories means all of you know. Now we are going to solve see the revision of the lesson and exercise. Let us revise. 1. India is one of the world's greatest democracies. Yes. India is the one of the world's greatest democracies and democratic country. India comprises of 29 states and 7 territories. India comprises 7 territories and 29 states. 3. The country is governed by the central or union government and the different states by the respective state governments. The gov our country India is governed by the central government and the different states by the respective state governments. 4. We Indians respect all the region, religions sorry religions we Indians respect all religions and the cultural diversity of our country. We are Indians so we should respect we must respect all the religions all the languages all the cultural diver diversity of our country. So we are saying all are Indians. Yes or no kids? Always we are saying all are Indians. Because of we are respecting our religions, cultural diversities. We all are one and we all are Indians. Next we are going to see the exercise. We are going to solve the exercise. Fill in the blanks. First one is the fill in the blanks. There are dash dash union territories in India. Just only we revise the kids here. How many territories are there? Seven territories. Then right here there are seven territories. Union territories in India. B. The dash dash largely take decision relating to the entire country. In India, two governments are there. One is the central government and the second one is the state government. In central government, who are there? Prime minister is there, no? Prime minister, then right here, prime minister. Prime minister, largely, largely takes decisions relating to the entire country. And in the uh, states, chief minister. In states who take a uh, uh, decisions, chief minister takes a uh, relating to the state. Okay. See, the capital of India is, the capital of India is New Delhi. Right here, New Delhi. Now, number two, state whether the following statements are true or false state whether the following statements are true or false a india is not a democratic country just only we revised here only india is one of the world's greatest democracies india is the one of the world democratic country yes or no kids yeah then this statement is wrong so you write here this statement is false okay b India has 27 states and 7 union territories. No. India has 29 states and 7 union territories. Means it is also false. See. We Indians respect the culture, religions of our people and do not force anybody to practice 
any particular path yes we do not force anybody we do not force anybody to practice any particular path we do not force anybody because we all are indians we, we respect all cul all culture religions of all peoples then this is the true this statement is true right here true next lakshadweepa d is lakshadweepa is not a union territory but a state lakshadweepa is a not a union territory wrong lakshadweepa is the union territory it is a not a state it is a false e the state government makes law related to the union territories to wrong state government makes a law for only their respective states not for a union territories huh? and country they make a laws they take a decision for their respective states so it is also false now we are going to see the question answers answer the following questions number 3 is answer the following questions okay what is the meaning of democracy what is the meaning of democracy look here kids democracy means the people of a country elect their own government democracy means the people of a of a country elect their own government in other word the people elect their respect representative who form a council of ministers and these minister make a laws and rule the country in other word the people elect their representative who form a council of ministers and these minister make a law and rule the country understood second question is name the official residence of the president and the prime minister of india official residence means means they stay president and prime minister of our india the president resides in rashtrapati bhavan situated at rajpath in new delhi the president resides in rashtrapati bhavan it is situated at rajpath in new delhi where why seven race course road is the official residence of the prime minister prime minister's official residence is the seven race course of course road understood now we will see the third question name the some religions that coexist in india name so many religions are there in that you write only some religions that coexist in india in india religions such as hinduism islam christianity and sikhism coexist people who also follow other religions like uh, jainism and buddhism understood kids these are your question answers i will give you this one in homework okay next see turn the page and look there question number 4 study the map of india on page number 172 carefully and write down the capital city of the following state study first study the read the page number 172 page number 172 read and see the capital cities of the following state turn the page kids look here page number 172 is there and you turn that one and look here read this one states 
states and capitals there here also states are there and their capital cities 29 states and their capital cities are given you read it carefully and answer the uh, answer the questions for that two minutes you pause the video okay first one is the odisha it is the odisha is state you find out the capital city of odisha look here kids in this year alphabetically arrange this one states odisha's capital city is the bhuvaneswar odisha's capital city is the bhuvaneswar so that type again next one you find out kids next is b what is there arunachal pradesh arunachal pradesh is capital city so you turn the page a where it is the arunachal pradesh arunachal pradesh capital city is the what itanagar arunachal pradesh is capital city is itanagar next turn the page see the question karnataka karnataka's capital city what is there all of you know because we are a, we are living in karnataka no then we all of course we know need that one our capital city bengaluru karnataka's capital city is bengaluru karnataka is our state where we are living tamil nadu tamil nadu tamil nadu's capital city is state is a tamil nadu and tamil nadu's capital city is look here kids in this one what is this chennai tamil nadu's capital city is chennai so you find out yes or no then write here i will write odisha's capital city is bhuvaneswar right here bhuvaneswar okay arunachal pradesh's capital city is itanagar karnataka's capital city is bengaluru last one is tamil nadu's capital city is okay next is number 5 name the following people here some people means the president of india the prime minister of india and the chief minister of what the chief minister of your state means our state okay we should write here the president of india who is the president of india right here sri ram nath ko vind sri ram nath ko vind okay next the prime minister of sri what right here na narendra d modi okay the chief minister of your state even in which state you are living you are there we are living in karnataka state means all of you know who is the our chief minister sri the chief minister of our state is sri b s edi u rappa b s edi u rappa okay b s edi u rappa is our chief minister the president of the president of india is ramnath who is ramnath kovind the prime minister of our 
the prime minister of india is sri narendra d modi the chief minister of our state karnataka is bs yadurappa now we are going to see the question number 6 identify the following people here two people's pictures given you see the photos pictures and write their name this one is the dr hamid ansari hamid ansari and this one is the our ex prime minister manmohan singh dr manmohan singh hamid ansari and doc dr manmohan singh okay this type you follow the first write down in your textbook first write down in your textbook then you copy all this one fill in the blanks true or false answer the following questions and this one for number question number 4 name the following five and this one copy down in your notebook okay kids thank you for watching the video